I have never been to an Arab place, so going to Egypt for recording the bongos for my cover song of Third Wind was quite an experience. The first thing you notice when you get to Cairo is the traffic and the honking. Everybody's honking anytime, anywhere. So we drove across the city to reach the famous Grand Bazaar, one of the greatest outdoor markets on the planet, full of clothes, carpet, jewelry, food and people. Then we ate some really good meat and headed to Giza. We arrived at the hotel just in time to see the pyramids and lighted in the night. First thing in the morning, a good Egyptian breakfast, then playing some pool, chilling, and then straight to the pyramids to see those beautiful architectural masterpieces. It's May, it's bloody hot, and you can smell history all around. It seems like being in a movie. After a ride on my camel named Mickey Mouse, it's time to move on. Next day, we headed to the fortress of Saladino with the mosque of Muhammad Ali that's made of alabaster. The air, the light, the colors, and the smell of the city were something really inspiring for what I had to play later on. We spent the whole day visiting some other mosques, learning about the history of this country, and personally get enriched by the atmosphere of this beautiful land. Then again, it's time to move to another part of the city. After driving among one of the poorer section of Cairo, we finally arrived in a quiet and peaceful place. The Christian Monaster. The atmosphere here was completely different comparing to the mess we found on the streets. History here is built on the walls. And I couldn't help it, I had to sing. The short journey could not have ended better than sailing the Nile River on sunset before going back to the hotel. We have spent two full days in one of the most iconic places on earth and I'm sure I'm gonna come back here to visit more of the country. But for now, it's time to go back to the hotel and get ready to fly the next day for another enchanted place.